Hey, what's up, YouTube? It's Explosion35 here with another review for you. And today I'm going to be reviewing my custom figure of the um, Visual Anti Spider Man from the Amazing Spider Man movie. Okay. Let's start off with, uh, like, um, what I did to the face. You can see he's got his hat. He's got his yellow sunglasses and his red mask. Okay. At first, the mask was like a green over thing from another figure. I got it from the John Con, uh, John Connor, um, Terminator figure, the head. I got it from there, and I, uh, cut off the brim of the hat, and I, um, Cut off, like, his little, uh, what do you call it? Like, a do-rag. I cut the bottom of it off, and then I painted it, and added the sunglasses color. So that's how I did that. Um, the body is the Marcus Wright body. Um, and I, uh, permanent markered the shirt and the legs, and I Mod Podged them, which works really well, and it gets done really fast. And, um... So that's pretty much all I did to this guy. Um, you could make it yourself with uh, all you need is um, black permanent marker, um, white out or like acrylic white paint, um, uh, red or red um, permanent marker, and a uh, Marcus Wright figure, and a um, and um, a uh, John Connor figure from the um, Terminator Salvation three and three quarter inch figures. All right, so let's go over articulation for this guy. I did customize these. I customize all of mine that I make, guys. Just so you know, um, the head goes side to side, up and down. Um, his arms go out about that high. Do three sixties. Um, bend out one point at the elbow. And uh, he has a little turn here, and the hands do turn. Well, this one turns a little better, see? Um, waist turns. Legs go forward. Bend at one point at the knee, and that's it. So he's a little bit limited on artic articulation. He's not as articulated as this guy. But he is um, pretty awesome, and... Um, it didn't cost me anything to do this, guys. Pretty much free. I mean, the two figures now are like two dollars each. If you could find them at a dollar store, um, the paints are like uh, permanent marker. You could buy it by itself, two of them for like a dollar. Um, and then the yellow permanent marker is a dollar too. Or so, er, yeah, so that's like I'm trying to add this up for uh, three, four, seven, and then you know. Seven dollars, pretty much seven dollars and fifty cents, really, to make it. But I already had the materials, so it wasn't that hard. So yeah, give you guys four three sixty. This is remember in the scene where he uh, is in the scene. Um, he's in uh, two scenes, I think, where he jumps from the heli. He jumps from the sky and he's hanging onto the helicopter. And then he's also swinging and he catches that guy and holds him. And then he's also in that scene where they catch him on video. So he is a cool guy to have in your collection if you get one and customize it. It really is. I mean, you know, I know they didn't make one, which they probably should have. But uh, let me just give you a quick size comparison. My three and three quarter inch custom Spider-Man. So he is like, uh, he is like a centimeter off, like. Yeah, he's just like a couple centimeters off, and he's fine. He goes perfectly well. Um, So tell me what you guys think in the comments below. Rate, comment, and subscribe. And I want to give a quick shout-out to Chad Ochafa 130 and MovieMan66. And if you do have a custom of this, let me know down in your comments below and tell me how to find it. And it's Explosion35 signing off. Bye. Peace.